So that company Cherry that makes your favorite keyboard switches also makes a number of other PC accessories, including gaming mice. So yes, as it turns out, Cherry makes a lot more things than just keyboard switches, which actually comes as a bit of a surprise to me. And we are pleased today to show off the Cherry MC 2.1 gaming mouse. It is a very low cost gaming mouse that looks like it has a number of nice features for anyone that is just looking for a basic gaming mouse that will just get the job done. And all right. Let's go ahead and dive in. First, let's take a look at the overall package that you get when you purchase the Cherry MC 2.1. As you can see, it is a very blank and generic box. It's got the Cherry logo on both sides. And then just Cherry on the front, like no picture of the mouse itself or anything like that. But on the side, we do get corded mouse and manual, yes. So, obviously this doesn't look like it's meant for retail in a big box location and more of an e-tail type of a deal, but that is A-OK. -okay. It's a sturdy box, so it's all that really matters. But, opening it up. Wrap. <laughs> Pull it out. Got our manual here that we will take a quick look at here in a second. And then just nothing else in the box. But again, bubble wrap. Yes. <laughs> and this is actually done up kind of interesting. There we go. It's like actual, like two segmented bubble wrap sleeves here. So if we pull the mouse out, maybe. Maybe we can pull the mouse out. There we go. There we go. There it is. That is very sleek to look at actually but anyway let's get the cord out now this is a corded mouse not wireless for those of you that prefer having a cord there we go so very long cord very cool but anyway let's take a closer look at this guy so on the sides we've got some uh feels like rubberized texture grips going on here with all these little beads those are very cool same on this side with our back and forward buttons. And those switches feel fantastic. Holy cow. Clicky. All right, so our main mouse button's here. Also very clicky. Scroll wheel, that feels good. And then we also have another function button right here on the Cherry logo, so that's cool. And that extends the entire length of this outline that you can see here. So that is well-defined. Very neat. All right, so grip test here. I've got pretty big hands. And that fits pretty well. Fits pretty well in a palm grip. A little small, but that's all right. Works for me. Very smooth glides. So we've got three really large glide feet here. That's nice. Uh, doesn't look like we have any sensor protection with glide pads going around here, so do be aware of that. But the bottom also contains just information about the product and the company, so cool stuff. But anyway, very neat. Nice form factor, very comfortable. Should not be a problem in usability department whatsoever. But as for the manual here, looks like your basic quick start guide more than anything, including a number of different languages. You know, I really don't want to look at this. Sorry, manual. I just, I don't care enough. But let's go ahead and get this one hooked up and give it a quick gameplay demo. So I went ahead and got the mouse hooked up to my PC real quick. And as you can see, the scroll wheel has some nice RGB lighting accents here. And in the middle here is an actual DPI switch that lets us select four preset DPI settings that we could customize in the Cherry Utility app on PC. So very, very cool. 
Now, before we dive into our gameplay demo, I am excited to announce that I have become an affiliate partner with Humble Bundle. For any of you out there looking to grow your PC game collection and support charities all at the same time, the Humble Choice Bundle is a great way to do both. And from now until September 4th, all new members of Humble Choice Bundle can use my discount code AG10 to save $2 on your first month of Humble Bundle Choice. To do this, all you need to do is click the link in the description below, click on become a member, set up your account, select the $11.99 a month option, and under the promo code type in AG10 and hit apply. That way you save $2 off of your first month. And with that code applied, you can now check out and enjoy your first month of Humble Choice. Again, this deal is only available to new Humble Choice subscribers. All right, so here we are loaded up into Apex Legends. Just a quick little brief demo on the mouse's like initial performance here. So I have it set to the lowest DPI setting right now. And it gives us some pretty good low level turns here. So nothing out of control. That's actually pretty nice. No dead zones of which to speak, which is fantastic. Buttons are very responsive. My aim, not so much. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Great low level DPI setting for sniping, that's for sure. So, for example, Vantage's ult here. This would be the ideal setting for this one, I think. Not bad at all. Scroll wheel works as intended. Let's pick up another weapon here just to demo that. So scroll wheel, very responsive. Over here. Follow Middle right mouse right button here. is what I have assigned to pings, and it works great. Let's go, right. Echo. I have tactical set to that. It's my ultimate set to that. So yeah, both my so both of my side buttons are working fantastic. Again, I have my ability sucks. set to side buttons, it it so it's a lot easier to use them on the fly. I love using mice. I don't like using keyboards. I'm a heathen, I know. All right, now let's go ahead and give that higher DPI setting a try. So this is the second one here. So this feels more in line with the DPI setting I would normally use in games. Much quicker turns, less movement needed to make greater quick reactions. So that is... Feeling pretty nice. Now for that third DPI setting, this one is getting a lot more sensitive, so for those of you that like having really quick turns, that is going to do you good, just with basic settings. Again, all these settings are tunable in the chair utility, and we'll cover that more in the final review. Just for this quick demo, we're just going over out-of-box experience, and gotta say, it's actually pretty nice. And then the fourth DPI setting is just your instant 180, 180 mode, look at that. Very, very high DPI setting. So yeah, this is feeling really nice, very responsive. I need to work on my aim. It's been a while since I've played PC games with the mouse, I must admit. But this one is feeling fantastic. That is our brief unboxing and gameplay demonstration of the Cherry MC 2.1. This is looking like it's going to be an awesome mouse to use and work with. It has just great functionality right out of the box. I'm really excited about it. And of course, we're going to explore the Cherry utility a little bit more and share more gameplay and in-depth thoughts with you in future streams and reviews. So be sure to keep it tuned to the channel to check those ones out. But if you'd like to check out the Cherry MC 2.1 for yourself before then, 
There will be an affiliate link down in the description below that you can check out over on Amazon. Help us out the channel, and uh, you can check out a really low-cost mouse. That seems like it's going to be an excellent performer. But again, stay tuned. Review for this one coming soon. Thank you again to Cherry for sending this one out my way for us to check out and unbox and review. And thank you to all of you for watching. Now, here at the end, do have a couple of huge favors to ask. If you haven't already, be sure to hit that thumbs up, thumbs down button, depending on how much you like this video, as well as that sub button and notification bell so you can see when new videos go live on the channel. And for anyone interested in further helping support the channel, be sure to check out that Humble Choice discount sign up thing that we talked about earlier, as well as checking out that join button here on YouTube or the Patreon link in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. A little goes a long way to helping us keep this place going and bringing all of this content directly to you. Big shout out to all of our current backers. Thank you so much for always believing what we do here and helping us keep it going. You are all just so incredible. Thank you again. But until next time, my wonderful internet peeps, you all stay awesome, keep on gaming, and we'll see you back next video.